the Nava family, Gustavo, Maria, Christopher, Jimena, they're different from everybody else because they just don't give up. They, they face life with their head up. Doesn't matter what they've been through and they just don't give up. Maria, she's coming and volunteering and she's saying, one of these days I want to become a teacher because I've seen the way how the children are, they're just so fun, and that's what her dream is, too. And she's learning English, and sometimes she's embarrassed to use it, but we tell you, like, don't be embarrassed, you know. That's the only way you can learn English, if you talk. And, and she will. She'll say some words in English and everything, but Gustavo doesn't give up. He tries hard, and he's the type of guy that he talks to you, and he's like, I want to do this, and if I had the money, I would go to school. And he's the type, when he's talking to you, you can see it, that he really does mean it. There's people out there that tell you, yeah, I want to go to school, but with him, it's like, you can tell, like, guess, because he's always checking online to see how much a course is, because he wants to go back to school, but he just doesn't have the money. They're just so happy people, and it doesn't matter. They've been robbed when they moved in, the flood, but still, they're happy people, and they say, you know, things come and go, but we're still here, and we're a family, and they just keep on going. And there's families that do give up and just have their head down, and, and not them. They keep on going.